Hello everyone. Today we are going to solve this number theory problem, which is a problem from shortlisted question of International Mathematical Olympiad, where we have to find positive integer solution to this Diophantine equation. And let's check how many we can find. So if you want to give it a try, pause the video. Otherwise, keep watching and see how to solve it. So let's start it. So first of all, see that if I make an uh, equation like with m, m plus one whole square gives me m square plus two m plus one. You see that if you compare, this is a square which is z, and this is you can treat like x but this is not a square okay but this is one yes so if we can make this middle term a perfect square then we can convert this equation into our formula so let's see how to make 2 m square 2 m into a square well it's very easy if i take m is equal to some power k 2 of k square then this thing becomes 2 into 2 k square which is 4 k square a perfect square we can write like this so it means nothing we have to do we have to only change m we have to replace 2 k square instead of m only so let's make it and see what happens so now we have okay so before uh, there was m but now we know that if we make 2k square substitution here for any integer 2k square and 2k this whole equation becomes a perfect formula 2k square plus 1 whole square is equals to this is 2k square whole square and this thing we can write as 2k whole square and plus 1 so according to our question this is now z this is x this is y let's try a few value and see what happens so now if I take k is equals to simplest form 2, let's see 2k square becomes 2 for the 8, 8 plus 1 whole square and here 2k square becomes 8 square plus 2k becomes 4 square plus 1. So yes this formula is working perfectly so it means we can use this formula so x square plus y square plus 1 is equals to z square for this we can use this formula that is derived by us 2k square whole square 2k square plus 1 is equals to 2k square plus 1 whole square. This is the formula we have. So this is the formula where k is any integer you can plug here positive integer uh, or negative integer also and you will get a solution every single time so actually we have infinitely many solutions this is a parametric formula for this problem this equation has infinitely many solution in positive integer thank you for watching see you next time